Central Park in general is a special place, but Strawberry Fields is really special for birders. Tell me about that. So uh, a lot of our tours start here in Strawberry Fields. It gets a little crazy later in the day with all the John Lennon uh, Memorial. Strawberry Fields is a pretty high point in the park and it gets some of the first light. When light hits the trees, the bugs get get going and, and, and uh, flying up and around and that gets the birds really excited. So birds hit forest edges where there's a lot of light and a lot of bugs early in the morning. On a good day during the spring, you can see 70 to 80 different species of birds in the park and it doesn't take us long to start spotting them. So we have here a cedar wax wings. Yes, wax wing. Yeah, so if, if you have a high, good high frequency hearing, you can hear there's a high little lifty yes, call. Yes. They're really beautiful little dapper guys. There, there they go. So these are, those are grackles. Okay. They tend to get overlooked, but they're actually beautiful, um, kind of iridescent black birds. Look at that. Yeah, he's looking for bugs down under the leaves. Take me through what a beginner who's got the interest uh -huh. would need to kind of get a good start at birding. If a birder has their binoculars and their field guide, you're sort of a, your own little you know, birding um, education system because you, you can just walk around and take your time and, and slowly get to know the you know, birds that are in your neighborhood. As we make our way into the Ramble, another birder's paradise in the park, we stumble onto a surprise. This is a black-crowned night heron, one of several species of heron and egret that nest on islands right in the New York City Harbor. Most people don't know that they even exist. They are gorgeous. Gorgeous, but with an ever-shrinking habitat, as man's reach into nature continues to expand, it's important to preserve these wild spaces, even in the middle of Manhattan. The more people are aware of, of the birds that are right out there, outside their window, you know, the more they'll want to do to try to protect them. Todd, thank you so much for taking us through the park. It was fascinating, absolutely fascinating. Oh, you're fascinating. welcome. Thank really you for coming. It. I hope this will get people excited to go out and look at the birds. I think so. You ready to look at some more? Let's do it. All right.